from her speech. I just want y'all to know. <laughs> she walked into that courtroom and said, Kamala Harris for the people. And she meant that. Many of you know her credentials. But what I love about Kamala Harris goes beyond her resume. Is that she sees the humanity in everyone. She's the only candidate in this race who is capable of empathy. When I first got to Congress, I wasn't sure I made the right decision. The Chaos Caucus couldn't elect the speaker, and the Oversight Committee was unhinged. I was going through all of this when I visited the Vice President's residence for the first time. As I approached Vice President Harris for our official photo, she turned to me and asked, what's wrong? Mind you, we'd never met, but she saw right through me. She saw the distress. I immediately began crying. It's all right, Jasmine. That's my rep. And the most powerful woman in the world wiped my tears and listened. It's so hard for me to tell this story. She then said, among other things, you are exactly where God wants you. Your district chose you because they believe in you, and so do I. All right, something good comes out of Texas. <laughs> the next month, I went viral for the first of many times to come. For hitting Republicans with a dose of their own medicine. That brief but impactful interaction gave me my legislative legs and I've been running ever since. The question before us is, will a vindictive, vile villain violate voters' vision? Ah, preach, girl. Representative Jasmine Crockett. 